here. Thought I'd look into the stereo replacement real quick. Popped off the pop off the uh, speaker just to see what was up here, and uh, so I've got a piece of of uh, looks like half inch plywood up here that it's mounted into. So that's that's all right. But look at the speaker. <laughs> so here's what you get. Yep, yeah, that's what you get. Unknown. <laughs> so yeah, I might even have a spare set of speakers in the basement. Back when I had the other truck, I had bought some other speakers. I might just put those out here. But uh, they're labeled positive, negative. Positive is the uh, the non-black striped one. Negative is the one with the black stripe. Pretty simple. So I may just not a whole bunch to that, but uh, that's going to be really easy to do. I just kind of wanted to see if these things were even labeled, and they're not even labeled. So anyway, thought I'd do a quick video. I don't know if we can see up in here or not. Eh. Anyway. So that's that, and then we'll uh, tackle the Jensen replacement. I don't know what I want to do with this. But I would like to get something a little nicer. I don't think I want to buy the Jensen RV-specific DVD player model. They've got them on eBay for like 160 to 210 or so. I mean, for that price, I can get a... JVC unit or even an Alpine for 200 bucks that would go in that slot. I'd have to do some no matter what I do I think I'm going to have to build a piece of wood to go here and mount it. But I don't know what I'm going to do there. Anyway. Alright. Just a quick little video on this speaker pullout. Thanks for watching.